doing a New Year's Eve look. Um, this is my first time doing a New Year's Eve look. And uh, I'm recording with uh, my Christmas gift, iPad, iPad 2. Yay! Um, so I'm just testing out because I know the iPad resolution uh, for the camera is kind of low, it's not very good. Um, but I just thought it's pretty convenient because I can see myself doing it. I don't even need a mirror. Um, I like it, but I have to see once I upload on my computer to edit and see how the quality is. But um, just testing out, uh, my boyfriend got me um, this iPad and uh, I really love it. So yeah, it's a really cool present. It's like the biggest present I ever received. I think. Anyway, so I did this look. Um, very simple. I just used uh, Kos BH Cosmetics or oh, Costa Sands, whatever you know. Like you can get those on Amazon. I only used two. One is the, I think the metallic one. The I think they call it Metal Mania. So this is the metallic palette. I think it has like 88 colors in it. And uh, I also use their. Um, the glitter palette. The glitter palette is not very glittery, um, and the shadows are definitely a lot smaller than the the other ones. But um, it's my first time using this palette. These two palettes. I mean, I have the uh, regular ADA palettes before uh, and the neutral ones, but um, I really like the the metallic palette. I think the metallic palette is really good because the eyeshadows are very pigmented. I didn't wear any foundations because uh, as you can see my face kind of going through a rough state. Um, I've been breaking out a lot lately. I think it's probably due to stress or something. I hope you guys have a great New Year's Eve and um, enjoy with your family and friends and loved ones. Um, I hope all of you have a great new year and a great 2012 so please and please feel free to um, follow my blog and comment uh, like comment rate and subscribe to my channel um, I will definitely have more time uh, from now on to do more tutorials so Please stay tuned and uh, I'll see you guys next year. Right. Take care. Bye. Happy New Year. I first applied an eyeshadow base all over my eyelid. This helped prevent creasing and also um, makes the color pop up more. flat synthetic um, eyeshadow brush and I placed a bright metallic orange color on the outer part of the top lid uh, you want to just place it mostly on the outer corner and then uh, extend it into the middle of the eye Then dip the same brush but the other side into a metallic gold eyeshadow and I'm placing this on the inner part of the eyelid and extend it into the crease. Uh, you want to blend it upward and also meet up with the orange color. Next, I'm using a synthetic uh, angle brush and dip into a penny copper toned metallic eyeshadow and I'm tracing my top lash line with this color.
Next, I'm using a bronze metallic eyeshadow and the same angle brush. I'm going to take this color and trace along the lower lash line from the inner corner to uh, the end. Then to line my waterline, I'm using a black eyeliner pencil dipped into a waterproof gum metal gray eye, uh, cream eyeshadow or eyeliner in this case and I'm just rim the top and lower lash line as well as the waterline. Find the outer corner as well as the crease. I'm using the same eyeliner brush dipped into a dark brown metallic eyeshadow. First, placing the color on the outer corner and then draw a triangle shape. And also, I'm dragging the color into the crease, um, but try not to pull the color all the way into the inner corner. And to blend the colors together and blur out the edges, I basically use my ring finger and just simply um, tap the color on the, on the outer edges. So this helps blur the edges without using another brush. Then I also place the same shadow on the outer part Next, I use a glitter glue base. You can use any kind of glitter glue base. Uh, I'm using the Too Faced one and I'm placing it on to the middle of my eyelid and using a flat synthetic brush, I'm spraying it um, with a toner or water. Um, you can even use an adhesive uh, base. And I'm dipping to a sparkly, glittery, gum metal, silver shade. And I'm placing it on the center of my eyelid. Just to add a little more uh, drama and dimension to the look, I'm placing a glittery gold um, eyeshadow, or you can use pigment, um, just on the center part of the lid. So this way it creates a more three-dimensional effect. I'm skipping false lashes, so I'm only using a vol volumizing mascara on both top and lower lashes. Uh, just give it a generous cold. You want to put several coats on so the lashes can look more defined and more dark. I've included some false eyelash uh, options. You can try these. These are with golden uh, tinsel. These are really fun. And then I included these. I got them from Forever 21. They're like a dollar or two dollars with rhinestones on top. And these are from Sephora. They're the one with silver tinsel. These are really nice. And also these are my favorite. These are fan out rainbow colored glittery lashes from Sephora. Now um, there are different color uh, lip color options you can use. Um, I really love the NYX soft matte lip creams and uh, you can do the classic bold red or 
bright hot pink, or maybe tone it down with something that's neutral, kind of peachy or gold, and then top with gloss. And this is、uh, something like red sparkly gloss. You can do that, or there's another option. Place a golden lip gloss, and I really like this one.、Uh, this one gives a, a sheen、um, and metallic finish. So it's up to you.、Um, I went for the classic bold red lip color, and I really like this formula because it's long lasting and it's soft on the lips. Uh, without over drying, and I top it off with a little bit of that gold gloss in the center of the lips to add more dimension. So this finished the look. I hope you enjoy it. And Happy New Year, everybody! Bye.